Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we are going to do quite the opposite. We're gonna rescue traitors. So yeah. It's uh, uh, kinda like a good quest, but it's somewhere else, not in the same place. Uh, I'll do it in a time limit. The rest uh, I don't wanna do, so yeah. He's back at Twin Blades Camp. It's uh, it's pretty easy, but as I recall correctly, the traders are uh, very weak when it comes down uh, to getting hurt. So, yeah, be careful with that. Oh, thank Avo you're here, sir. The situation is bad, sir, real bad. The bandits are demanding protection money from the traders' union and took three hostages to show they mean business. The union's refusing to pay up, even though today is the last day. They called me because I owed them a favor, but, well, I just got out of guard college last week and I only got a C- in hostage recovery. Know what? I'll tell you where they are and leave you to it. Let me see. Uh, oh, yes, now, there's, uh, there's one's down the hill and uh, there's two more on the other side of them big gates. All clear? Right. I'm going to make a tactical withdrawal before they see me. <laughs> Alright, uh, good luck. Yeah, a tactical withdrawal. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to be using a lot in this uh, mission. To spell up uh, slow time. Uh, that's why up until this point I upgraded the spell because I really need uh, You know to slow time and get the traders in time And I'll be like zoning uh, and The trader will be zoning with me and The slow time also helps so that when the bandits are trying to attack them. They don't have time, you know, so uh, here I'll have to fight a little bit, not that much. Let's see, a couple of bandits on this side. It's gonna be annoying to let uh, some of them alive. Okay, so... That time limit seems reasonable, because honestly I didn't know it was that much of a time. My trader seems to be hurt a little bit. Grab this guy. Oh man. There we go. Yeah, everyone tries to aim for the uh, for the trader, so slow time comes in, comes in handy a lot in this place. So you'll be able to defend them more, more easily. I don't know if I'll be upgrading that spell once again. Uh, it seems pretty good as it is right now. And uh, I'm still debating uh, what, I, well, what I will do with the, you know, my uh, main weapon for the game. Because honestly, there, I, there's a big chance in the end that I'll get a really good weapon, though we'll be getting to that later. Alright, there's a guy up here. I did try and catch uh, bandits with my summon, but I already got one and he seems pretty good. Took me a while to take him out, so... I'll assume that he's pretty strong. Although I, I'm, I'm really interested in uh, seeing if I can get monsters like... Uh, I don't know, some uh, big creatures with more agility and stuff like that. Okay, so this path is clear. Obviously, in the exit, guys are waiting, but I'll still zone. Now, here I might, I might have to take care of the enemies, because they'll try to stop them. And I'm not sure if, uh, if it's uh, that I have to take care of all of them. Otherwise, the mission will be over, so I'll just make sure. I'm just glad that this sword uh, deals a lot of damage. Uh, and 
later on I'll be having a way better sword. It's basically the same design, but it's the mass. Uh, I think it's a uh, master or something like that. It's really, really good. It's probably like the uh, kind of like a third or fourth best weapon in the game, because later on there'll be like legendary weapons and stuff like that. And maybe things that I don't know of, but not big deal since uh, sword is not really my uh, big uh, concern here. Since I can combine magic and, and meal me melee at the same time. Well, since I'm doing this so quickly, I'll be starting off the uh, the main quest, I believe, the yellow one. And then it'll take a couple of uh, parts because it's really long. Okay, here I get a cutscene. Fantastic. Oh shit. It feels good to be free again, I can tell you that. Ah, oh, thanks. Asher, you're a splendid fella. I'll be sure to give you a discount on my wares if I ever see you again. Alrighty. <clears throat> there we go. <clears throat> and I completed the boast. Alright, so... This is, uh place that I'm supposed to go that uh, Mace told me on that last cutscene uh, automatically the quest starts but I think it'll take a couple of parts to finish well not this quest specifically later on there's gonna be a quest that I'll have to do it here also oh the fishing, fishing spot I'll let it out some gods can be fickle. And we are back. I just got a fish, unfortunately. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see. These are obviously new areas. Areas that can't be reached but on foot. Uh, here's a uh, mini boss, I guess. Oh yeah, the rock guy. These guys will uh, come in handy uh, later on when it comes down to training for your, uh, your strength. Because since you get to hit them a lot of times, uh, your strength points are going to be going up a lot, as you can see. So I can really uh, take advantage of that later on when I try and go and train, because I believe... Uh, this monster appears uh, on this puddle spot all the time. I think so. I, well, uh, I think they are uh, uh, in different areas from this whole place. This place is filled with the uh, Balberines and rock type monsters such as this one. Uh, but yeah, not to worry. They're not really that strong. As you can see, you can beat him down easily with. Uh, anyway. Uh, fine, but this is my way. Uh, Berserk and uh... oh crap, I forgot. <laughs> yeah, they hurt you when you're close to them. So yeah, it's like a last resort thing. I don't know. Oh, and I get uh, a thousand experience orbs, which is pretty good, I guess. So that is like a, a thousand of physical and a thousand of general points. So. Yeah, that's, you know, you can come here and train and you'll get a lot of points. But still, seriously, later on, uh, we'll be getting way more points than this, so it's going to be sweet, really. Like, there's a, there's a point in the game that you get ridiculous amounts of points. Like, wow, it's really great. Oh, crap, this place. I really don't have time to finish that. I'll edit out the fishing, though. Ah, oh, silver key, cool. Alright, so this is all the time I have. This is Usumachi speaking. Thank you for watching and see you next time, guys.